Dear Joy, the day has finally come when I get to see you walk down the aisle towards me where we will then exchange vows of commitment to each other. And I will forever be able to call you my bride. I wish I could share with you all that I've been feeling, thinking, and experiencing at this moment, but it would take a lifetime to do so. Thankfully, I'm marrying you today, and I will have the opportunity to share this with my best friend. I've never had anyone in my life with whom I could be so transparent with about my dreams, hopes, and even weaknesses until I met you. Since the inception of our relationship, God has used you to sharpen me into the man He wants me to be. He brought you into my life during a time I felt I was growing and learning so much, only to use you to teach me more. I've learned from you how to be kind, loving, compassionate, and yes, even a little romantic. All the areas in my life where I have been lacking, you have perfectly complimented me. Leading up to this day, all I've been thinking about is how can I love Joy better? How can I meet her deepest needs? How can I help her fulfill her dreams? What I've learned is that without Christ, I will never be able to love you well. So it's my goal to place them at the head of our relationship in order to see our love grow. Joy, I promise that I will always choose to love you, pursue you, and point you towards Christ. You are my bride, and today when I commit my life to you, I will do so with the understanding that I will be until death do us apart. I love you, Joy Carol Martin, forever you are, Sam. My dear Sam, it is so surreal that we are finally at this moment. I'm so excited to seek God with you, bravely and constantly. It is an honor to serve Christ with you as my best friend and so much more. You are such a breathtaking reflection of God's heart for me, and my heart is enlarged by your gentle strength. It is my prayer for our marriage that we never get too comfortable with the splendor of our Creator and His creation. I'm so thankful God chose me to be yours. I feel so privileged to be the one to help you love life, to hold you with tenderness, and to live within the warmth of your heart and call it home. I will finally share that I pray we run this race fully committed to the end until we hear the words, well done, my good and faithful servant. Glory to our almighty King. Love you, your wife-to-be.